And this is a really... Well, it's not a naughty recipe at all, because you're cooking it. But it looks Let's... really naughty, because... It, was this... Did you... Who did you make this for? So, Sam Smith um, really loves to eat fried chicken, and he was, he was missing that. He wanted a healthy version. So I thought, I'm sure that there are ways. I'm always trying to make healthy versions of the classic comfort foods. Yeah. So this was in my last cookbook, and uh, it's super simple. All I do is get some chicken drumsticks, which you marinate overnight in a little bit of water, some salt, and some kind of sweetener. I use something called coconut blossom, which is just a really healthy, natural sweetener, but you could use something like honey or maple syrup, just a little bit to give it some flavour. Yeah. And then a good friend of mine who's a chef taught me this trick. Instead of roasting or baking the chicken, you steam it. So you're going to keep the, the chicken really nice and tender, mm -hmm. which is what you want for a drumstick. So I've got some steaming there, but I've got some that I made earlier. How long do you steam those for? Um, about 15 minutes, mm -hmm. just to get it nice and tender. And then, so this is some that we did earlier. And then all you want to do is dip it in some... So skin on? Yeah. Yeah, nothing that's wrong. good. Nothing. Oh, exactly. That's OK. Honey. Exactly. So just um, dip this in a little bit of egg yolk. And then I've made a nice um, crumb. So obviously I'm gluten free and lots of people are trying to give up bread and, and wheat. So um, this is just an alternative. I got some red lentils, which I blended. How clever and, is um, that? Oh, I was meant to add these. Um, so I've got some turmeric, some coriander, some um, cumin, some paprika and some thyme. Give it thyme. that kind of flavour. give it those lovely flavours. Mm -hmm. And is this sort of close to... Um, the colonel's recipe. Exactly, exactly. Because <laughs> that's, My quite, yeah, that's yeah. quite important to me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. Well, I think well, you will be the judge in a minute. minute. I will be the judge, <laughs> because I'm a bit of a connoisseur. <laughs> <laughs> it's my only one. It's my I'll see that on the pyramid. <laughs> <laughs> um, so then you'll just fry that down? Exactly. So just fry it in some oil. We've got some um, here that we did earlier, so it's just a case of making it a little bit crispy, so you don't want to do it for very long. Because they're already cooked inside. Exactly, exactly. So it's just about crisping up the outside. And mm. then I've got some that we made earlier. OK, bring it over Please here, because you've also made a coleslaw, which I thought would have been a real diet no-no, but clearly not. Well, coleslaw, not a diet, again, it's a healthy great, eating. It's exactly, it's a great way of getting vegetables uh, into the diet, so there's nothing wrong with coleslaw. So all you do is have some um, cabbage, which I've shredded, some carrots, some spring onions, and then in the book I've given a recipe to make a really healthy mayonnaise, because there's nothing really wrong with that, it's just eggs, but yeah. um, some of the store-bought stuff has a lot of sugar, yeah. but you can get some good quality mayonnaises. Um, can I also ask you, because you're, congratulations, you're four months pregnant. Thank you. <laughs> um, would you still continue doing this sort of thing? I mean, obviously you don't want to lose weight when you're pregnant, but I guess, as you said, it's just still being very healthy. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I think pregnancy, everything changes, um, your food taste change, etc. Yeah. But um, for me, it's just about making sure that you're nourishing yourself all the time. Mm. Is that right. getting the thumbs I really up? love Is that it. Good? Flavour fantastic. Um, it, obviously, you can tell me. that you've got the difference with the... Um, with the, with, the with the lentils, it's slightly different. A little bit more crunchy, Crispier. it's quite nice, actually. Oh, it's quite Good. nice. Good. I like do it. Do you like it? It's passed the test. Oh, yeah. And believe me, Hooray. I'm very, very <laughs> picky. A delicious. A really delicious. A brilliant and alternative. And some coleslaw mm. there as well. Oh, yeah, have a dunk in that. Um, that is lovely. Thank you very, very much. My pleasure. Let me pleasure. Just, Thank you. Let me just get this out and put <laughs> grease all over it now. <laughs> there we are. That's, um, that's what we've been talking about. That's how long, how long, pyramid, generally, normal person, not Sam Smith, um, uh, if you were to do this, would you expect to lose weight over? Um, all of the clients that I had test this plan before it went into the book, everyone that had weight to lose started to lose weight within the first 10 days. And obviously, if you continue eating this way, I mean, I'm all about healthy weight loss, so that's not the rapid, quick, quick way. It's so like long-term, well, sustainable. Should you be losing? It's so Personally. different for everyone. It just depends on what they've got to lose. So I'd hate to make that kind of judgment, but it absolutely works. People lose weight when they eat this way. And okay. It's about eating more and eating the right things. Thank, Thank, you. You. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much. much.